year when many people began setting New Year's resolutions, but there may be some new goals that people don't consider. Valley News Team's Nishay Taylor explains. Losing weight, exercising more, or breaking an old habit are all popular New Year's resolutions. But experts say you should also be setting financial goals for the new year. Make sure that you have the appropriate amount of savings. And savings is important. Uh, thing to do. It's hard to do if we wait till the end of the year. Making sure to have an emergency stash can help protect you from the unexpected. We typically recommend, you know, three to six months of emergency savings in case you were to unexpectedly lose your job. Um, also, unexpected expenses were to come up. And getting started with your savings plan can be very simple. Maybe take 5% of your paycheck out. So if you dedicate part of your budget to saving monthly or every paycheck, even small amounts will add up. Rising prices are still tugging at most consumers' pockets, and reviewing your budget can help with finding ways to cut costs. Things add up that we don't expect that they would. Whether it's Hulu, Disney Plus, you know, Amazon Prime, you know, take a look at all those things. Maybe there's subscriptions that you're not using anymore that you can cut out. Wealth professionals say putting together a financial plan ahead of the new year could be very beneficial, but they add it's important to be realistic about your financial goals. We don't want to get defeated and, and not, you know, commit to something throughout the year. You know, just like any of our other goals, uh, health, the fitness, those things, if we don't set attainable, realistic goals, we're not going to do them. In Fargo, Nishay Taylor, Valley News Live. Financial experts also say looking at maximizing your retirement plan can also help with saving for the future. A 